Welcome to downtown Halabadu. Last known resting place, the Tusk of Ganesh. Spectacular. Hmm. Hmm, what? Doesn't it look like there's a dam or something between the two Ganesh statues? Must have been eroded by the falls. So how do we get in? Hmm. Yeah. Look at the crown. It's not wear and tear. Right? Maybe it was a watchtower? Bet that's how the Persians got in. I have heard about this place for so long. <laughs> I can't believe I'm actually looking at it. You should take a picture. Send it to your dad. Great idea. What? You're one of those cultures who can't work a computer? Just take the picture. Show it to him in person, then. No, it's uh, just a few decades too late for that. Look, I'm... Oh. Oh, God, please, no. It's fine. <laughs> Shall we, uh, head over to Halibadu? Stands, but they're gone. Maybe their king should have used their wealth to protect his people and not make such an inviting target. Thoughts how we get up to the crown? Did you bring the helicopter? I left it at home. Um, then I guess we're climbing. <laughs> Over here. We can swing across. <laughs> okay. Ready? You first. for a way up. There, look. You can see some structures beneath the falls. You're right. Up here, coming. Come on, this way. You sure it's safe? You know, you keep asking me that. It'll save us both some time if you just assume it's not. Oh, 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 oh boy. 
It's definitely not safe, by the way. I saw. Think you can get back up here? Yeah. Keep going. I'll catch up. <laughs> <laughs> Please. I didn't, actually. Once you said Gamesh was the number of obstacles. He's more than happy to place them in your way if he thinks he'll benefit. That why the horse and I chose him for Halibadu. He's also the Lord of Good Fortune, the one you pray to for prosperity and success. Got it. That's cool. Doing great, China. Thanks. I'll be doing better when we get to the car. Surprised we haven't seen Saab yet. Not going wood. Like he's around. Doubt we'll see him up here. Why is that? He doesn't have the stones to climb this high. <laughs> I think I see a place we can swing over to the crown. Just a little farther to go. Oh. Oh, oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Thank you. Hurry up and climb. I'm slipping. Worth it? Impressive. Yeah. Oh. Now, how do we get off this thing? Okay. Easy does it. Really? When are you going to be back here? It's more sturdy up here. Don't jinx us. Oh, Is our way in? Courtesy of the Persian army. <clears throat> Nice shot. Persians must have had a trebuchet. Trebuchet? Can't you just say catapult like a normal person? A trebuchet is a type of catapult. It can handle heavier projectiles, like this one, and fling them longer distances. Right. You learned that in your military training? I looked it up on Wikipedia, like a normal person. Incredible. 
It's our old friends, Parashurama and Ganesh. Friends? Looks like they're fighting. Well, when the Hindu gods aren't off fighting demons, they're sometimes fighting each other. <sighs> Ganesh isn't even armed. I guess it's not really his style. this whole place out of the mountain? Sure looks like it. Through here. Hey, look. Armaments. You were right, Nadine. I have no armaments. There's no Persian? Ah, uh, looks to be a mix of Persian and Hoysala. First line of defense. Now we're getting somewhere. Another one of these doors. Now let's see. Oh, good. This one actually works. There we go. Nice to get some light. Feels like a crypt in here. Crypts and burials aren't really a Hindu thing. They generally favor cremation. It's a beautiful ceremony, Antiishti, Sanskrit for last sacrifice. Sacrifice? The idea is our bodies are merely borrowed vehicles and you're returning it so that others might benefit. It's a lovely sentiment. Too late for these poor bastards. Hey, up here. What the hell? Jesus. This was it. Their final stand. Oh, wasn't enough to save their empire. But their loss is our gain. Here's our way in. Nadine, can you lend a hand with this chap? Sure. Come on, old fellow. Here we go. Excuse me. Sorry. We must be getting close. Hopefully closer than these guys. Well, this device looks familiar. Let's hope it doesn't turn on the water in here. Well, that's different. What is all this? If I had a guess, I'd say it's some kind of lock mechanism to open that door. Okay, on the left, we have Shiva gifting Parashurama the axe. And on the right, we have Parashurama chopping off Ganesha's tusk. Wait, with the axe? Yeah. The one that Shiva, Ganesha's father, gave to Parashurama? Yeah. <laughs> it's messed up. That's family. <laughs> Come on, let's see about opening that door. So how does all this work? Uh, I don't know to find out. Let's 
see what this does. Alright, that slid the piece away from me. It's shadow move too. Let's try this. Over you go. I see what's happening. The shadows must be here. Right. So let's see if I can line them all up. This actually looks like fun. I think that's it. You did it. Doors open. All in a day's work. Salah and the tiger. Here we go. Fingers crossed. That's supposed to happen? I know. Just don't get us killed. You're no fun. Ready? Ooh. Careful. Mm. Amazing. What a shaver. Mm, my thoughts exactly. Oh no, no, it's okay. I think we're gonna be okay. Okay? Where the hell's the tusk? I don't know, none of this makes any sense. Yeah, it does. The Hoysala sent us on a fool's errand. I think you're right. Terrific. No, hear me out. Ganesh is the symbol of... Halabadu. And Shiva, that's the symbol of... Below. Which was the old... The old capital. Exactly. What if the king built this spectacular city, and it was a wonderful target for the Persians? And the old capital was forgotten. So this whole city was a decoy. What if they let it get plundered, to protect Belor? And their treasure. I'm willing to bet the tusk was never here at all. So where's Belor? Oh shit. This is definitely not supposed to happen. It's coming loose! Oh. Grab the edge, quick! Oh. 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 Lisa! I'm okay! Go!
talent. A little bit of luck. Oh. Hey. Nice work, partner. A nice work. Put it there. Jesus. <laughs> what was that? I'm really embarrassed for you right now. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, but wasn't there a huge waterfall here? There was. What the hell is that? Aqueducts. <laughs> the water's channeling there from the falls. Amazing. Did we do this just now? Well. Technically, I did. Cocky. <laughs> Look, uh, sorry if I cut you close to the bone back there. Oh. That's all right. You know, you two would have got on like a house on fire. He was also a really stubborn dickhead. <laughs> None of this could have possibly gone unnoticed. We should probably get out of here. Good point. Follow me. Right. Oh. The water is being channeled toward the gate, so let's follow the aqueduct. Copy that. We'll take more hits. So they flooded their city to protect their secrets. You think the soldiers knew they were being used as decoys? Honesty's not always the best policy. That's true. You need your people behind you 100%. So you think Asav's keeping his men in the dark? Uh, undoubtedly. Look at this. They're making Don't. progress, no? Maybe. But check out this watch. Took it from that old man. Yeah. 